Hello everyone, welcome back with another downrange segment from Quarter Custom Rifles. I'm joined with Alan today and I'm Keith. We're going to go ahead and talk about truing your ballistics. In a previous segment, we discussed building a ballistic profile and now we're here out on the range and we're going to do what we enjoy doing, which is shooting at some distance. What this process actually is, is you're going to be taking and using the range finder with the profile that we initially loaded into it. We're going to range a target. It's going to give us a dial up with the environmentals and earth-based effects factored into it. We're going to have Alan dial up and then he's going to give me a shot on target. Now if he's high or low, he's going to tell me what the adjustment is. We'll make that adjustment. I'll do a calibration and then we'll move out to a further distance. The further out you do these calibrations, the more refined and more accurate it's going to be. So let's go ahead and get that first target and get some rounds down range. Alan, if you don't mind, look inside that scope and give me a wind speed right now. Got a right wind. Let's call it a total of three miles an hour. Put three miles an hour in the range finder. Three miles an hour. All right. About 12 minutes. Yeah, you're going to be, yep, 12 minutes. All right. Go ahead and get our right. hearing protection in. What's my, what's my hold, wind hold? Give me three just quarter right. second. You're going to hold three quarter right. All right, Alan, let's go ahead and transition to the thousand since the elevation was good. Come up 27 and a quarter, and you send it whenever you're ready. Your hold is going to be a minute and a quarter right. Low. Low? How low? Go ahead and do a Ooh. dial up and see what it comes out to. It looks like, let's see, that's almost two minutes low. Okay. All right, we are confirmed. Let me make these adjustments real quick and get this calibrated. So what I'm doing now is I'm going in here and setting this up with the, uh, the calibration. So what I'm gonna do is fire this to wake it up, select the calibrate. I'm gonna go into it, put in the distance, which was 1,002 yards. Then I'm gonna go and put in the actual drop what we dialed to shoot then I'm going to hit calculate and it's going to go ahead and give me a proposed what the muzzle velocity was I'm going to hit set muzzle velocity I'm going to back out hit save and then I'm going to sync it one more time just to make sure it goes into there and I'm going to give him a I'm probably going to let you go ahead and shoot again have you shoot that again I'll okay. just shoot the left target all right I'm going to hold a minute and a half right ready yep go ahead and send it Perfect. All right. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and come back to 600 and engage it just to make sure everything's tracking. All right, it's gonna be 12 minutes. You're gonna hold three quarter of a minute right if it's still the same speed. Elevation. Looks perfect. All right, awesome. Great shooting, good job. All right, so this concludes this downrange segment this week on truing your ballistics. I hope everybody got some good information out of this. Once again, this is Keith and Allen with McWhorter Custom Rifles.